Today I'm showing you how to make a pull apart cupcake cake perfect for your Easter celebrations. To start I'm going to show you how to make the buttercream. So in my mixing bowl I've got some icing sugar and to that I'm going to add all of my ingredients. So I have some butter, some milk and some vanilla extract. And then we're going to mix that on slow until it starts to come together. So once it's come together, I'm going to scrape down the sides of the bowl to get any of the excess icing sugar off and beat for a further five to seven minutes. So my buttercream's been beating for about six minutes and it's a nice paler color and it's very fluffy. So I'm going to pop that in a piping bag. Once your buttercream is ready, it's time to decorate. For the bunny space, you're going to need 11 cupcakes. If you need a recipe, you can click any of the links on the screen. I'm going to prepare my cupcakes so they're all level. So I'm going to take a sharp knife and I'm just going to cut along the top. Once you've leveled off all of your cupcakes, you can transfer it to where you're going to display them. I've chosen to use a chopping board just covered in some cloth. For the ears, we're going to use four cupcakes. So we have two on each side. Next, you then want two underneath. This will be the start of the face, so they're close together. Next, you want a line of three. And then to finish, just two on the bottom in the middle. And there you have your bunny's face. So we have four cupcakes for the ears. This will be the eyes. We have the cheeks and nose, and then just the chin. Next, take your buttercream and smooth it all over the top. For the inside of the bunny's ear, I've decided to use desiccated coconut and I've just added a splash of pink food colouring to give it a bit of colour. So I'm going to take that and sprinkle it in the inside. For the cheeks, we're going to roll out some pink fondant and cut out some circles. I'm then going to take a cookie cutter and cut out two circles. Because we want the bunny to look cute, we're going to spread the cheeks out quite wide. For the eyes, we're going to take a small bit of black fondant and roll out two smaller circles. I don't have a cookie cutter small enough, so I'm going to use the back of a piping nozzle. Next, roll out some white fondant to make some pupils. And this time, I'm going to cut a bigger pupil using a Wilton 12 and then I'm going to use a tiny Wilton 2 to get a small little dot. So we're just going to add the pupils onto the eyes. And we're going to add a small one just underneath that. We're then going to place these just above the cheeks. And to finish them off, we're going to take some black fondant, a very small amount, and roll it out like a sausage. I'm then going to press them into each other and then we're going to curl it round on the edges. So we've got a little smiling bunny. And then I'm going to pick that up and put that onto our cupcakes. And then we have our cute very easy bunny. So I've reached 20,000 subscribers and my videos have been watched over a million times so I just want to say a massive thank you to all of my subscribers. When I first started I didn't think I was ever going to get here so thank you very much. So that's a pull apart Easter bunny cake, easy. For more videos, subscribe to my channel. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave any requests in the comment box below.